Hey everyone, Technoment here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your touch screen not working after the iOS 18 update or any update. If it's not working, you can't touch it. It's not functional. You want to follow these steps. First thing you got to do is quickly press and release the volume up and then quickly press and release the volume down and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. So again, quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and you're gonna hold on to the side button just like this. And just keep on holding that side button. You're gonna wait until the screen goes completely black before you let go of that side button. So we're gonna wait for it to go black, and then we're gonna wait for the Apple logo to be and let go of that. And this is gonna basically force the phone to shut down reload the code so if it's a software related issue it's going to go ahead and fix that which most likely is the reason why you may not be able to touch the screen it's not functioning it's glitching whatever the case is go ahead and try this and if it doesn't work for you the very first time you're just going to keep on trying it this method does work and now you do have to get it right you have to quickly press and release the volume up volume down and then hold on to that side button just like this as you can see here i'm doing it again holding on to that side button during this process as you can see here and just be patient and keep on doing it. As you can see here, we're gonna wait for the Apple logo to appear and we let go of it. Again, reloading that code, it's gonna fix the software related issue, which most likely is causing the screen to not work if it was working before and you did an update. So keep on trying it. Again, we'll take a few tries sometimes to get it to work. And after that, you should be good to go. Now there's another thing you can do if you're still not getting it work, which is gonna be uh, trying to update it through your computer which i'll leave a link for it if you want to check that out and that does take a little bit more further effort so this is why you want to try this method to get it fixed right away so that's all you need to do i hope this video is helpful if so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone we'll see you guys next time